If I tell you there's one thing on earth you can't stop, can you guess right now what it is? If you think it is the time, then you're right. You can't stop it, but measure it with a watch. The journey from clock tower to wristwatch was not smooth. In the 14th century, Peter Lightfoot, the monk of Glastonbury, first invented a modern mechanical clock. But did you ever wonder how the clock got so small, advanced, and became the symbol of luxury lifestyle? And what are the greatest classical luxury brands on the world market, and how are they keeping up in this digital era? Let's find out. Rolex, the most recognized and number one luxury brand in the world. The brand was founded by Hans Wilsdorf and Alfred Davis in 1905 in London. After World War I, the economy of London had a downfall, so the company had to move to Geneva, Switzerland and register. In the 1960s, Hans Wildorf Foundation owned the company and became part of his private family trust. Yet, Rolex gets 100% brand recognition. Rolex can produce 2,000 watches per day right now. The brand focuses on both men's and women's categories, but most of the models and customers are in the male category. GMT Master 2, Yacht Master 2, Day Date, and Daytona are the popular series customer's first choice. Rolex has a superlative chronometer. What is it? Well, this meter is the worldwide best recognized meter for wristwatches. The human movement can't affect the time lap of the watch, and they make one of the best meters so far. Rolex is not behind in sports watch categories alongside luxury watches. They understand the customer's needs and the market to dominate worldwide. The brand was founded in 1848 by Louis Brandt. The company officially registered the name Omega SA in 1984. After that, there's no stopping. The brand dominates the world as it did before. Another Swiss jewelry industry, the Swatch Group, subordinated the brand. They improvised the cosmetic look of the models and reached the peak of luxury aesthetics. From NASA to the US Army, British Royal Flying Corps to wealthy industrialists, use the brand as a luxury symbol of lifestyle. Omega owns the 70% brand recognition and the most expensive price around the globe. Speedmaster Pro is one of their most popular series so far. The watch was part of the famous Apollo mission on the moon. The model is also called the Moon Watch. You must notice the watch with another famous 007 name or James Bond movie series. The productions of this series love the brand. You can see James Bond actors, Daniel Craig, Pierce Brosnan, Sean Connery, and other actors put on this luxury brand in their exclusive scenes. Rado is obsessed with aesthetics and durability from the beginning of its journey. The company was established by three brothers, or you can call them Schlupp. The brothers shine after World War II when peace comes to Europe. Golden Horse is their most popular series, and then the successor was Green Horse. They are the first to advertise the first water-resistant watch. Then guess what? They were considered as the most famous durable brand in the world. The company got permission to spread their business in the year of the 1950s globally in 61 countries. As I told you, Rado is obsessed with their design language. They took a different approach. Rado produced ceramic shield bodies, or you can say ceramic watches, when the other brands used metal. So they got the title of Master of Materials. The oldest Swiss brand in our list is Patek Philippe. In 1839, the brand was established and continues its journey to this very day. Unlike Rolex, the company is located in Geneva, Switzerland. The company was owned by the Stem family from 1932. Later, Antoni Patek and Adrian Philippe ordained the brand and titled it with their name. Unlike Omega and Rolex, the company is recognized as a prestigious watchmaking brand. How? From Queen Victoria to Queen Elizabeth II, from sports personnel to film personnel, many wealthy and high-profile people use the brand. So the brand is one of the first choices of customers around the world. Therefore, they have more than 400 retail locations in Asia, Europe, North America, and Oceania. Zenith is one of the oldest Swiss watch brands in our list after Patek Philippe, though it is not a Swiss brand anymore now. The company began its journey in 1865. Favre Jacot was the inventor of this watch concept. He targeted the features, ease of use, and class. So the benefits were instant. Zenith became the market leader and owned the demand of the wealthy class people. The company's unique innovation and selling point of view hold the name of the company for the century, yet the brand owns a large number of shares in the market. 
Therefore, in 1999, the French luxury goods company LVMH bought the brand. Zenith has a continuous production chain and fulfills the desire of the classy customers. If you think Swiss watches are recognized as prestigious, then hold on. Japanese brands have a glorious history and worldwide demands. We want to keep the name in our list. One of the most famous brands in Japan, Seiko. The brand was founded in 1881 by Kintaro Hattori. The headquarters are located in Tokyo, Japan. Though the brand launched with clocks and then pocket watches, later they started dominating the wristwatch market in Japan and around the globe. Seiko was the first to introduce quartz category watches in the world. They brought Dia Shock, a shock resistance device at first. Don't be shocked yet, there's more. They introduced self-winding watches and became the pioneer watch seller of the market. Yes, we know what you're thinking. Japanese companies are always advanced in innovation, something new and unique. It would be shameful if we don't tell you about Citizen. Like Seiko, the company is situated in Tokyo, Japan. Citizen has a great track record and market-leading position. The company runs its electronics division and mechanical watch division at a time. And they're successful for their long-lasting and reliable products and services. The company was established as a joint adventure project by Japanese and Swiss investors in the 1930s. The brand was registered in Switzerland first. The Swiss watchmaker Rudolf Schmidt used to own the company controls. Later, he sold it to Japan and another watchmaker, Goto Schnippai, took control over it. Citizens have some significant inventions. The company invented multi-band atomic timekeeping. Unlike Seiko, it could perform automatic but in multiple time zones. This watch technology can keep up time accurate and synchronize the automatic clock. It could synchronize with radio time in Japan, North America, and Europe. 